Hey GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is your host Zlot, and we're here today doing the Alpha 9 series. And we are, I think we're ready to take this thing to go rock and roll. So I had a bunch of ammo made up. Um, oh, you know what I didn't do? I didn't get Pentax that I've been making up some fuel we'll take what we've got eh, i don't think we have much we might have to make fuel on the way let's take a look let's take a look what do we got here uh, that's done so that was ammo and how's the other one going that one's still making fuel okay uh oh we didn't grind up any taxes so we should probably do that and you know what we can do that uh we can probably do that on the ship although that unnecessary waste of energy so let's let's do that with this one and we'll just put it out to here is fine because we got to grab the rest of that anyway so um what do we want we want a whole bunch we want like i don't know 150 that should give us a stack of 300 refined that should get us around for a bit <clears throat> okay so while it's making that the other things are making a fuel we did make a bunch of o2 and i think it's all fueled up anyway so i think what we can do now is let's jump in we'll take a look I find that amusing. So, for some reason, the oxygen cannot penetrate the inside of my turned off CV. Yet the temperature stays at 22 degrees. Oh, man, I just, I don't get it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, there's there's things in the game that it, it, it's just like, uh, um, what? <laughs> Why, why? Okay. Let's get out of that view. Yeah, there's no, there's no, um, there's no cockpit windows. <laughs> so, I guess what we'll do is we'll just uh, Wi-Fi all this stuff into it from here. So, we'll go into the base. And we'll grab what we need. That was mostly in the dump chest now. So we'll put, we'll go into an ammo one. And we'll get this dumped in there. Can all fit in no problem. <laughs> God. Didn't take up that much at all. Yeah, we could probably fill this full. And then same with the other one, fill it full. <laughs> and have ammo for days. Days okay. Um, that was fun. Let's that can hold a crap ton of stuff. This kind of stuff, though, here we just we just need it to go into one of these. So let's. I want to take all this with me. Might be able to sell a bunch of it. Take all the O2. Yeah. Oh, our laser guns. We're going to take one of those. We might be able to play with that a bit. Uh, we're going to take all that. Is that all it spit out for us? Are you sure? That doesn't sound right. Really? Two more? Really? Why is it so slow? I thought it was faster than that. I mean, these are advanced constructors, are they not? Okay, well, that's fine. <clears throat> Let's fire it up before we suffocate. And what do we got in the way of, so we can, can we just fill that? No, we're not connected to the right thing, right? Yeah, we need to be connected to this to fill it. Okay, so now if we went into this, we could just go like that. And Oh, that reminds me. That reminds me. Let's grab a bunch of fuel. Let's grab all the fuel. 
Uh, so we're gonna grab all this right now. Uh, we're gonna grab some extra taxid, just just cause, just cause, and then what else? What else? Um, you know what? Let's grab, let's make the controller, container controller. Is that going to be our main one or should we do the wood and ore as our wood and ore into the container controller? Yeah, the container controller, 200,000. wood two. Yeah, let's do, because we don't need a huge one for the mats, I think. Well, we might. We'll see. We'll see. Um, okay, let's make this one our main one that we're going to be using. We're going to connect to this. And then <clears throat> uh, we're going to give ourselves a stack of everything. Not Sathium, though. Not Sathium. Uh, what about Cobalt? We're going to need Cobalt. We need... We need more wood. So we're going to need to grab stuff when we go back down to the planet, go back to the planet anyway, or one of the planets. So we're out of magnesium. So we need magnesium, we need sathium, we need stone. And it wouldn't hurt to pick up some more logs too. So we don't need all these. We just need... Six is good enough. Okay. Uh, we do need some stone, though. We're going to get more stone. I just I just don't want to be screwed. We'll grab some of the Prometheum. You see that? We're already almost up to 8,000. And this is just just getting basics. We haven't even got all the basics that we need. Uh, also, we're going to grab a couple stacks of that. Uh, you know what? You know what? You know what? Let's, let's actually grab a little bit more that way. If it's going to be a little bit extended, we can make fuel and O2. Although that's grabbing a lot. I'm, I'm, I'm hoping to go grab some more. So I think that's more than sufficient. Okay, and then, oops, why did I close that? Now what we want is we want, um, let's grab a bunch of this. We can just throw this. We can throw it in the fridge for now. That's fine. Grab 40 of those. <clears throat> okay, so how are we doing here? We've got our our controller for uh, the um, constructors, and then we have a bunch of cargo boxes holding stuff that's not super heavy that can, we can definitely fill that up with like O2 and stuff, but okay, is that gonna be enough? Well, it's gonna have to be enough. That's all we got cooked up for now. That should be sufficient. That should be, should be quite sufficient. So, uh, what else? What else? We've got fuel. We've got warp fuel. We've got ammo. We've got food. We've got, yeah, I think, I think we're good to go. Let's go. Let's go. So, we're going to take off. Fire up the engines. And, oh, you know what? You know what? We need to... Now, grouping stuff does not kill the... Will it kill the... Do I have it ever, all funky groups? I don't have funky groups made. I don't have any funky groups made. At all. What I mean by funky groups is anything out of the default that it would put it in if we went like this. And I don't. I don't have any custom groups made yet because all the weapons are off. 
And the other stuff I have from switches, so that's signal logic. This ain't going to break that. Okay, and these retain their shortcut anyway. So that doesn't break that either. What it allows me to do now is I can go in here and I can get rid of the predator crap. Uh, I can get rid of... What I do need to do now is actually make a couple of custom ones, I guess. But in the meantime, we'll get rid of the thruster, warp drive, apply that to the group, right? Although, oh, you know what? You know what? I do need to remove the sentries out of there. I don't want them. I want the sentries to actually be able to deal with Predator. Okay, so we won't be grouping anything past this. I think this is it. We're done for grouping on this thing. So, so let's make a custom one. And we're going to call this the sentries. Uh, sentry guns is, is good. Okay. Um, and then we're going to move all of the sentry guns into it. So let's add to, and now this alphabetical orders this, doesn't it? Yep, there it is. Very cool. And that we can go group to last, 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 group to last. Okay, now they're all in here. This one, I want predator. I don't want bases. Okay. Actually, I don't want my big ones shooting at the base turrets either. But, or my cannon guns. Uh, but I do want them shooting at base turrets out in space. So, I'll, uh, you know what? I'll just leave. This is fine for now. We'll apply this to the group. So, so basically, um, yeah, let's make. Oh, we got it. We, we have one, actually. We can just use that one. There we go. Perfect. Uh, what about the mini guns? So we could we could break out the. The rest of the the other two into their um, corresponding groups too, but I think for now, whoa 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 whoa, let's let's just go. <laughs> Whoops, I think I clipped my base. Can I damage it? Maybe. We'll check later. Okay, so this thing. This thing is, without a load, it's crazy fast. This thing is a combat fighter. It's not a frigate, so to speak. This is a highly maneuverable, fast, heavy armor. Uh, and that's all it's got is its speed and armor. That's what it is. And that's all it has room for. Um... But we did put a bunch of cargo in it on the inside. And we've got a little bit of a... We've got small enough bay. I think we can go get our stuff. So I want to... What I want to do is I want to head back to the snow planet. Yeah, I know. Really? Back to the snow planet? Yes. Back to the snow planet. Okay. Come on. Thank you. So we're going to do... Go here first. <clears throat> and where are you? Where are you? Where are you? You are right there, foam. So you can see how quickly this thing gets up to speed. It's like super fast. Now, the problem with this thing is it is a fuel hog it's not a daily driver this is it's not really intended for what i'm doing using it for right now transporting stuff 
Although it can work for it in the meantime, it's just, it's more of a combat vessel for space. For taking on POIs, not for PVE, or PVP, I should say. Uh, okay, so let's check out what we got here. And so I will come look for this at, on a, these ones that we discover, I'll be coming back to off camera and looking for the frickin' asteroids to uh, mine. Okay, Renane, let's go there. And the other great thing is the fuel tank on the CV is much bigger for warping with, so I don't have to keep fueling it up every single time I warp. Okay. Okay. And yeah, what was, I think it's just the standard stuff in orbit here, Promethium, I'd like to find that. So I'll probably look for all the stuff in orbit here too. The Promethium, I wanna get actually pretty much all of it and just drain it, just suck it dry. Take all of it. Okay, so let's head down. Whoa. Huh. Should we test this thing out against that thing's defenses? Now, the only problem is I should actually, if I'm going to do that, I should turn my, my um, rocket turrets off. Or, well, you know what? Let's hang on. Go into my rocket turrets. We're going to load those up there. Now, or my rocket launchers. Now my rocket turrets, they're only going to have, what, 60 to load with? So I've only got three rocket turrets. The only problem is I think it'll shoot at drones. It might shoot at drones. Oh. Oh. That's the... Nice. Okay, well, we found the trading station. Uh, let's make a permanent waypoint. Oh, actually, let's change that. Let's change that to base, target, flag, flag, pin, resource. It's a base. Yeah, let's use that. Uh, did it not? Whatever. I don't care. Okay, so we have the trading station oh and that looks like that looks like a a resource asteroid right there that just popped in it is what is it why is it not telling me did i It doesn't tell you anymore, eh? Oh, I can see it on the map, though. That's interesting. So I'd have to, I'd have to mark it. So that's a come on, cobalt asteroid. Let's just, uh, we'll waypoint that. Oh, see now it's gonna waypoint us. Because <laughs> that's the, yeah. Oh, really? shenanigans let's remove it then oh come on really we're gonna remove no I don't want a house there oh. <laughs> come on that's not it why is it so okay okay you know what 
we'll just can I edit it? Yeah, okay. So we want that. There we go. <laughs> ah, shenanigans. Now that's the only one I see. That's cool. That's cool. So this is cobalt. This is cobalt. We could we could try mining a little bit. Let's uh let's line ourselves up here with our nearly fandangled drill. So from previous experience it can't point down very well, but it can sure point up really good. So I think we'll want most of it up and then we'll go forward just a bit. Okay. Let's see if that's close enough. So we're going to go on devices and then we're going to go, should be under harvest, right? Yep. See that we could aim right to the bottom of it and yep, there it comes. Crushed stone and cobalt. Nice. Nice. Okay, I am going to mine this up and I'll come grab you guys. Okay, we are back. We mined it right out. Uh, let's take a look at what we got. We, ooh. So that's good. That's going to be, that's close to 6,000. That's about 5,500 ingots. So that's a lot of cobalt. I don't think we're going to need much more beyond that. Uh, crushed stone. We will need a lot more crushed stone than that though. So that's fine. Let's go back down to the planet and get our stuff from our base that we've left. And... Oh, what was the weight on that too? That was just under 7,000. Okay. Cobalt's actually kind of light then. I'm not really sure where the base is. So I think once we get down in the atmosphere, I'll probably, uh, I'll probably stop recording, fly to the base, and then we'll, um, we'll finish the episode. Ooh, it is actually getting long in the tooth already. Let's just, uh, get down here. Get above the water. Okay, uh, wham, there is the planet. <laughs> Just like that, let's level off, take a look really quick where we are. Yeah, we're, we're way the hell over there in unmarked territory. Okay, well, at least we're going to, we're going to discover more stuff. And there is some deposits and stuff I could go clean up with the hole mold before I grab it. And that's exactly probably what I'm going to do. So let's head over to the deposit bunker. 11k. Wow, we're right. We're exactly at 100% power usage. That's funny. I've never seen that. Perfectly 100%. Okay. Missing ammo, why? What's it shooting at? I am like way millions of miles away. Stop shooting. Oh, ridiculous. What are you shooting at? The infinite... Infinite frickin... Range bug. Where it doesn't actually have the range, but it thinks it does. So it empties all your ammunition. <laughs> It just wastes it. Completely freaking wastes it. 
Uh, it's good to know that the bugs persist from alpha to alpha. No, no, it's not good to know that. Okay, I'm gonna... What? Stop, stop it. Stop shooting that crap that you can't get to. Stop it. Okay, I will come get you when I get back to the base. Okay, we have arrived. So let's, oh, why is the ramp still, st I'm going to have to check out the signal logic on the, on the ramp. That's weird. Anyway, let's, uh, let's land. Uh, we'll swing around and have the back facing that way, yeah. See, that the whole point of this base was to be able to do this and have... See, I could, I'd be able to back right up into the protected zone. Well, even further if that one panel didn't break due to SI. Then I'd be able to, like, land, and it would be inside the sealed protected area. See, I could have even backed up quite a bit more. But, but that was the concept. This is the concept I was going for, so that I could bring in a small, mid-sized CV and literally get its butt, its, its, its hangar bay, inside the the um, area that's all secured or well that's uh, environmentally protected um, environmentally protected <laughs> uh, okay so you know what I think this is good enough here I'm just gonna shut these off we'll leave the turrets on that's fine we'll leave the turrets on okay so I'm going to call the episode here. We've landed back here. Um, I am going to go take the mine. What I did discover on the way here, uh, not only another silicone, but a crash capital vessel also. So I'm going to go and take a look at that crash capital vessel, see if I can uh, salvage anything good out of it. Um, we might do that as an episode. Take the HV out. Hmm. You know what? It'll be boring. It'll just be going and multi-tooling down the crash capital vessel, mining out a couple of deposits, and bringing it back to the dart. Yeah, we're just going to mine out pretty much what we can see here. Uh, it's too bad we haven't found any more promethium. We might take the SV around scouting a bit. Uh, yeah, you know what? That's what I'm going to do off camera. I'm going to go around and scout out the planet, finish scouting it out, and figure out where I need to go and get some uh, for some mats. For promethium, I, I mainly want to get all the promethium up off this planet. And then, uh, and in the meantime, what we can do is let's jump out because it's cold right now. And I can go right down to the bottom is fine. And we're going to go check on our water, see how those generators have been doing. Now, I don't know if time actually progresses forward on this play field when if it's shut down I don't actually think it does but uh, we'll see oh I'm too too far away from the uh, CV that's fine we got a critter right above us not a big deal and all these ran out okay well yeah they uh, they did it. They did their job. There we go. So I will transport all that stuff. Uh, I'm not connected anymore, am I? The Wi-Fi won't connect. 
all the way up there. It's a little too far. Yeah, that's fine. What I can do is I can I can bring it up in the uh, in the HV. I should be able to bring up 32. I should be able to bring up all the water. And uh, yeah. So next episode, I think what we'll do is. Okay, it's like. It's like right on right above me. <laughs> it's kind of freaking me out now. Yep. Wow, a whole pack of them. Okay, well, unless they unless they walk over here and fall down onto this ledge, they're not going to get in here. That's why I built this specifically like that. I guess I could... Uh, it's probably all borked still isn't it I removed all the uh, the stuff off of it anyway what um, no, at least it doesn't show this to be screwed up without any solar panels <laughs> okay well I gotta transfer all the stuff out of here because I think there's a bunch of crap still Maybe not. Maybe not. Did I grab everything last time? I might have. I might have grabbed. I put all the blocks into the uh, factory. Oh, it's gonna start hailing. Oh crap! I'm gonna I'm gonna start getting pelted here. Oh, actually, I should be okay here. I should be okay here, but. Uh, I'm going to go back up into the CV and call it an episode because I think the hail is going to start pummeling me any second here. So any second, I'm going to start taking damage from it. And that was the other reason why I wanted to have a sealed, this base sealed because of the ridiculous... There we go. We're safe. Okay. I'm going to call it an episode here, guys. Uh, next episode. Uh, I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do for next episode. If it's going to be discovering, finished discovering this plan. I think I'm going to do all that off camera. I'm just going to discover the whole thing, figure what there is. I'm going to go mine up pretty much the whole freaking as much as this CV can hold and, and stuff. And then we're going to try and head back home and dump it off. Um, and then maybe we'll just go on a warping spree and warp around and check out the rest of the galaxy, see how it's laid out, uh, see what the orbits have in the way of resources for to mine. And yeah, I mean, I also need to level up. I need to hit level 25 so that I can actually put real drills on this thing and get the level 25 gear. Okay, guys. Well, next episode, uh, we will probably have a shite ton of stuff to bring home. So until then, you guys have yourselves an awesome, awesome day.